Hi, I'm Anupam and I welcome you to Sanjeev Kapoor Khazana. Like always, I'm here with another exciting recipe and this time it is a fish pie. It's a sorted fish pie so I'm going to use lots of seafood in it and we're going to make this lovely cheesy melt in mouth pie. And I know all of us like making pies. We've seen so many pies here. We've seen apple pie, we've seen chicken pie. So this is a special recipe. It's fish pie. And to make fish pie, what do we need? Let's quickly run through the ingredients and let's collectively make fish pie. So here I have fish, prawns and squids. I have two types of cheese here with me. processed cheese and mozzarella now for the white sauce we need butter flour and milk apart from that we need onions chopped garlic boiled potatoes and for seasonings we need salt and we need some dried herbs and apart from that i have a pie dish which we have lined with savory short crust so this is something that you need to make and keep it handy before you make the pie filling okay So what we have to do first is we need to make a white sauce. So to make white sauce, I have a pan. We take some butter in this. And in the butter, let's add in some flour. That's it. So once you add in the flour, just mix it up, don't let it brown. Now to this, we'll add in milk little by little. And what we need to do is we need to whisk this. add the milk mix it make sure there are no lumps in this we we'll need some more milk to this but before we add in milk what we should do use a whisk you can get rid of all the lumps that are there so now there aren't any lumps and now we need to add in milk to this so you add milk little by little and get this entire thing incorporated into it nicely okay so the white sauce is more or less done what we'll do is we'll just season this up with a little bit of salt just a little bit i'm keeping it on a different flame and i'll also add in a little bit of milk to this that's it so here is the white sauce which is getting cooked now Now simultaneously what we'll do is we'll take another pan and in this we'll make the filling. So you have to this let's add in the remaining butter. Okay so the butter has almost melted. Let's take the garlic. So here goes in the garlic along with garlic let's add in some onions. And that's it. A little bit of onion. Saute this up. Do not let it brown. Now to this we'll add in a little bit of dried herbs. So onion, garlic and herbs have been sauteed nicely. Now what do you have to do is we have to add in all the three seafoods. Now depending upon the seafood which takes longer time to cook is what will go in first and the one which is most tender will go in at the end. So the prawns will go in first. And this has to be done on high heat do not let the prawns leave out any water so make sure it's all done on high heat followed by some squids i'm going to be also adding in some potatoes to this these are boiled potatoes the fish is something that we have to add but we'll not add it right now we'll add it towards the end In this let's add in the entire white sauce that we've made. Now followed by a little bit of the fish. So here I have boneless pieces of fish which have been cut into pieces. So just mix it up. Don't overcook it because now the entire thing is going to go in the oven and we are going to bake it. So this mixture is done. a little bit of salt just a little bit more of salt and since we have two types of cheeses with us a little bit of cheese also in this now nothing now let's just put the entire thing in the pie dish just take a fork and just level it up like this 
after you've done this just take the cheese now you need to put both the cheeses mozzarella at the same time you'll also need to put the processed cheese so this is mozzarella and processed ready to go in the oven oven is preheated at 180 degrees celsius so we'll put this pie in and after the entire cheese is nicely gratinated we'll bring it out cut it into wedges and serve immediately it has to be served piping hot because the seafood would have been cooked the cheese would have been melted and the pie is any which way is cooked so enjoy the crusty pie and the lovely cheesy seafood filling so this is my recipe of fish pie especially for you do try this recipe and let me know if you like it but i'm very sure you're going to love it i'm sure you all love our recipes so to stay connected please don't forget to subscribe to our channel sanjeev kapoor khazana